my playthrough of Dinosaur Discovery on the um, BBC Micro earlier this week, I thought I'd try out the other game I remember playing in the late 80s at my um, primary school in Surrey, England. Um, and that's Granny's Garden, which I think is from the same company, Formation, who s still exists today by the looks of things. This game was, is actually available to buy, I think, still. And it's also out on iOS, because I bought it last year or the year before, I think, on my iPad, just to show the kids what sort of stuff we used to play it back in the day when I used to go to school. So the kids have played this last year and I have helped them play it. So uh, I'm fairly familiar with it. I put blind play through as one of the tags because I'm not overly familiar. So that's a bit of a stretch. But anyway, let's give it a go. Hopefully um, it's all going to work. I had a bit of an issue getting the um, disc to load into the emulator, but I found a way of doing it, so ready to start. Yes. Amazing music. This has the scariest witch ever, as you can see on my overlay. That is the witch who turns up and kills you, basically, in certain places. I imagine it scared the crap out of uh, kids. Anyway, this bit I've never understood. There is a magic tree here. I swear all these trees look the same. I think you just need to find a random tree which is marked as magic, but there's no distinguishing features. I think it's just teaching the kids, you know, trial and error. I can't see any. Can you see any different? So you just go through them all. So let's just go through A1. Not enough magic. B1. Not enough magic. C1, not enough magic. D1, not enough magic. <laughs> Thrilling start of stream. A2, not enough magic. B2, not enough magic. C2, enough magic. We found the magic tree. Jeez, ear piercing sounds. Beautiful, snowy landscape. Welcome to the Kingdom of the Mountains. Do you have a password? No. Do you see? Okay, so that password is... Um, if you get to certain stages, you can then come back and you don't have to go through the whole game. Can you see a cave? Yes. Do you want to go in the cave? Yes. Oh, a red path has appeared. As if by magic. Here we go. You are inside the secret cave. The king and queen of the mountains have been locked away in here by a wicked witch. Their six children have been taken away and hidden by the witch. Okay. Would you like to help the king and queen? What happens if you type no here? I won't, but what happens? You must try and find the missing children. first one to look for is a girl called Esther. See, I remember that name, Esther. From playing this. The King and Queen's pet Raven will help you. Alright. Here it comes. Here he is. Right, mate. How are you going to help exactly? I am the King and Queen's Blue Raven. I have magic powers. Would you like me to help you? Yes. We must go to a woodcutter's house. The witch has made the woodcutter leave his home. Now it's a prison for Esther. Are you ready to come? Yes. This is the woodcutter's house. Would you like to go in? Yes. Before you can go in, you must solve a little puzzle. So this is a edutainment game. So it's got um, fairly simple word puzzles and... Um, Maths puzzles and memory games and stuff. There's a secret word on the house. What is it? You can see there in the blue, an F, an I, and a G. So it's fig. Now we can go inside, but we must be very careful. The witch has set some traps for you. Would you like to take an apple from a tree? Yeah, why not, you know? 
apples don't have a dubious history of witches, do they? Keep the apples safe. I will let us in now. It's very dark. Oh, we're in the hallway. It's very dark, but you can see a long stick by the wall. Are you going to take it? Yep. Got an apple and a stick. Very dark. You can see it. Door lean to kitchen. Door lean to back room. Cupboard and some stairs. Kitchen. Now, I played this for five minutes earlier just to test that it's all working. And I got this far. We're in the kitchen. There's a huge cooking pot hanging over a very hot fire. I wonder what is in there. Are you going to look in the pot? And if you look in the pot, that horrible witch turns up and basically eats you or whatever. I don't think she eats you. I don't think it's quite that gruesome. But she captures you or sends you away. So I'm not going to look in the pot. I'm sure the witch will catch me at some point later on in the game. But if you look in the pot here, you get caught. So no. Leave the room. So we kitchen is no good. Let's go to the back room. We're in the back room. There's nothing here except a small wooden box in the corner. Let's open the box. There's a note inside and it says, it's not in this room that you find for which is broom. Okay. So that's a pointless room. Uh, cupboard. Let's check the cupboard. Oh, it's very cold in it. Oh, you said a red broomstick. Are you going to take it? Do we want a red broomstick? Yeah? Uh, <laughs> uh oh. This is what's going to scare the kids. Look at this. Gruesome. What's going on with that nose and the chin? Ha ha. Now I've got you. I will send you home at once. Okay, so don't go in the kitchen and look in the pot. Don't go in the cupboard and take the red broomstick. Right, start again. S. Yes. I hope we don't have to do that bloody tree bit again. I've got a nasty feeling we do. <laughs> Get on with it. <clears throat> God. Right, let's see if it's always the same. What was it? C2? No, maybe it's not. Was it C2? D2. Okay, maybe it is random. Uh, A3. B3. C3. D3. B2 It's going to be the last one I try, isn't it? There we go. Alright, sit through this gruesome music again. change the screen size slightly. There you go, that's a bit better aspect I think. No. Yes. Yes. Okay, yes. So don't look in the pot, don't go in the cupboard and take your red broomstick, so let's just go straight upstairs I guess. We can speed run it now. Magic powers, yes. Okay. Yes. Yes, fig, okay, yes, I presume Kate taking the apple's fine, I presume taking the stick is fine, let's go up the stairs, because we know the other stuff's no good, a uh, snake, I think it wants to eat you, what can you throw at the snake, apple, 
Good shot. Killed the snake. I didn't want to kill it. Blimey, I've killed the snake. There's a note and it says, Esther is in the house, hidden well from you. Look again and you may find that one broom is now two. Back down the stairs. Okay, so if we look in the cupboard. No. Okay. Um, back room. Okay, so where's this other broom? A kitchen. No, don't look in the box, it's where the witch is. Um, Cupboard again. Green broom. So there's suddenly a green broomstick. So let's take the green. That's got to be the. Whoops. What's happened to the typing? Green. Won't let me type. <laughs> What's going on? Bloody hell. Oh, are you going to take one? Sorry, I'm being an idiot. Sorry, this this game is uh, this game's aimed for at uh, six-year-olds, and obviously I failed. Well done, you found Esther. Remember this password, Snow. Sweet. So, let me just write down that password. Snow. So that's the first child done. Press S to start again. Oh, we don't have to do this bloody magic tree stuff again, do we? Surely not. Got a nasty feeling we do. Okay, so we have to do this every time. Might get lucky and get a. Uh, what have I done? B2. There we go. Okay, yes. Are you sure? Yes. What is your password? No. We found Esther, yeah. Gotta find that dear Tom now. And come to Raven. Hurry up, mate. I will help you find Tom. He's been hidden in the giant's garden. I will take you to see my friend the toadstool. Hello, I am the talking toadstool. Okay. Cool. Look at the animation. Tom is hidden on the other side of a giant's garden. He will need some help to cross the garden. You will need some help to cross the garden. These creatures can help you. Worm, bee, snail, spider, butterfly. You're on the edge of a wide pond. You will need help to cross the pond. Okay. What's going to help you cross the pond? Bee or butterfly? What should we go for? Bee? You shit. I cannot swim. Oh, I will try to fly with you. No, too heavy. Okay, we can try a butterfly. Nothing can swim, can it? It's a butterfly. I will try and carry over pond. Hold on tight. Here we go. 
We have done it. Now you are across the pond. You have to go for a small wood. Set off through the wood. A shower of nuts is falling on you. The nuts hurt your head. You need help. The nuts are hurting you. One of the creatures can help you. Uh, if we need protection, maybe try a snail. We can go in his shell, maybe. Look at this fella. Come on, mate. I will be able to help you. Come inside my shell with me. Now we're safe from the falling nuts. We must cross a flower bed. Okay. What have we got left? There are lovely flowers here. Look out. An army of ants is coming. You need help. The ants might bite you. Snail, spider, bee. Spider or worm, I reckon. Should we try worm? We can like tunnel underground. Here he comes. Hello mate. I will dig a long tunnel. Wicked. Nice. Cheers. Thanks very much, Mr. Worm. We will soon be safe from the ants. Excellent. <laughs> You must follow a twisty path. Spider? A bee's no use. You're too much of a wuss. You hear a growling noise. A huge black dog is coming. Dog has big yellow teeth. You need help. Dog belongs to a giant. Which of the creatures can help you? Bee or spider? Maybe the bee stings the dog. Let's try that. So what's the spider going to do? Hello. I'm the one to help you. I'm going to buzz off after that dog. Good man. Now you are safe. I stung the dog's bottom. Nice work. You can see a very tall tree. Okay. There's something at the top of it. I think you should climb the tree. The tree will be hard to climb. You need help. I wonder if you can climb a tree. One of the creatures can help you. Well, the spider. He's the only one left. Come on, mate. Show me the way. Show me the best path, maybe. I'm the one to help you here. I will climb up and drop a thread. Cool, it must be strong. Strong thread. Well done, we find Tom. Remember his password. Sky. The rest of the program is on the next program. So find someone to help you. Let's see whether we can... Uh, God. What is it, Sky? A one, B one, C one, D one. A2, B2, B2, okay, oh, it's music, awful, awful music. Okay, do you have a password? Yes, yes, Sky, okay, Esther and Tom, Anna and Claire. So, looks like it's all on this one disc. I was a bit concerned I was going to have to find a second disc, man. Uh, you're doing very well so far. Before you can carry on with your adventure, you need to call an adult. Okay. Let me see if I can get this working. I think I might have to do this. M loan. Maybe try Grand 2. Tape, 
remember having to do all of this crap on home computers? I had a spectrum, so it's always load, quote, quote, or something. Or two dots, two dots, as I used to call it when I was eight, because I didn't know what quotes were. Is this going to work? Ready to start? Yes. Okay, part two. Wicked. Got to do that tree again. <laughs> What's the password? Sky. Oh, good. We don't have to do the tree again. Awesome. Just check Sky, yes. What is your password? Sky. Yes. Claire and Anna. So if we find them, that's four out of six. So we're making good progress. All right, come on, mate. Take us where we got to go. Uh, City of the Dragons. Of course I'm brave enough. Cool, look at that. Looks like Japan or something. Oh, who's this fella? What, is he shouting? Or... My na oh, sneezing. My name is Achu. I am the keeper of the gates. Alright, fair enough. Before you can enter the city, you must answer my question. What is your favourite food? Uh, sausages. Whenever I have sausages, I start to sneeze. He's off again. Okay, mate. There's a little girl here who seems to be lost. Her name is Anna. Okay. If we, oh, you can take her with you to meet the dragons. Whoa. These big dragons are going off to hunt for their dinner. Okay. At least they're not going to eat me. Or not going to eat me yet. Off they go. Whoa. These, oh, I remember this. You have to give them food, I think. These four baby dragons have been left behind to guard Claire. You have to tame them. Luckily, I have four magic collars which will make the dragons tame. You can only catch one dragon at a time. You can make the dragons come out by throwing them their favourite food. Each dragon has a different favourite. Okay, let's write this down. Three bags of chips, three oranges, three lollies, three buns. Okay, if you run out of something, the witch will, oh good lord. Remember, you must try and make the dragons come out on their own. Which food do you want to throw at dragons? Let's start with bun. The red dragon loves buns. The green dragon sometimes eats them. Okay. Buns. Red loves green some blue some and the yellow hates them. Okay. You can put magic color on the red. Okay, we got the red. Let's try it. Orange. Okay. Orange. Uh, some hates, loves some. Okay. Chips. Chips. Uh, sometimes, sometimes hates, loves, and now lolly. Lolly hates, loves, some, some. Okay. Right. So what have we got? We've caught the red. So we need 
What about something that Red hates? He hates... God, God knows. Let's just run through them all again, see what happens. Oh shit, that's the one I shouldn't do. Because the red's always going to come out for buns, isn't he? Okay. I won't do bun again. Oh, bloody red dragon. Comes out for everything. I'm going to run out of food here. Yeah? I don't know what to do. Uh, maybe, maybe once you got a collar on, it don't. Oh, I don't know. Let's try again. Like I say, this is aimed at primary school age children. I am forty, and I can't do it. Yes. Base, sky, yes, yes. Oh, come on, mate. Yes. Let's get through all this now, if we can. Oh, it's bloody a chew, isn't it? <laughs> Can't skip through it. I have to go through this sneezing lark. <clears throat> What's your favourite food? Uh, crisps. Whenever I Chris, I start to sneeze. Da 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 da. Couple of sneezes. And uh, dragons turn up. Go away from dinner. Off you go, baby dragons. Got to give them food. I don't know how to do it because I'm not clever enough to play a child's game. Off we go, very, very slowly, to go and get dinner. Okay. So don't run out. Let's chuck the bun again. We've caught the red. So I think if I throw another bun... So if I throw another bun, am I going to die? I can't throw any buns now, can I? Um, orange. Can I put a collar on the blue now? No? Why can't I put a collar on the blue? That's so confusing. It's just the same thing happens every time. Now I'm out of buns and <laughs> oranges. I'm out of all food. I'm out of everything, I think. Oh, how confusing. Right, maybe next time I don't start off with buns. I don't know how you're meant to do it. Because they're all the same things. One person loves it, one person hates it, and the other two sometimes eat it. So what are you meant to do? You're just meant to get lucky or something. Right, let's have another go. Yes. 
This guy. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yes, Sky. Yes, yes. Hmm. I might be just being really thick about this puzzle. Surely. Surely it's not just hoping you get lucky. You're relying on... Oh, God knows. You're relying on loves. I don't know what you're relying on. I'm terribly confused. Yes, here he is. Getting a bit pissed off at this guy. At you. Yes, keeper of the gates, we know. Answer the question, what's your favourite food? Cock. Whenever I have cock, I start to sneeze. Excellent. Here are the dragons, they're off for dinner. Take it to the dragons. Oh, what I could do, I could use the old save state. I'm going to use a save state in case I mess this up again, which I'm likely to do. And then we don't have to go back to the start and go through all this crap. We can just reload save state. That is what I should have done before. Got to tame them. Four magic collars. Da -la -la, wondering that time. Favourite food. Which will come. Okay, right. Where are we? File, quick, save. Okay, let's try it. Well, I won't go bun. Let's go lolly. Okay, we caught the green. Wicked. Now, can we catch the red knight? Um, orange. No. Chips. No. Bun. Okay, we're getting somewhere. So what have we got? We got... Who did we catch first? Oh God, I've forgotten. We went lolly, didn't we? So that must have been the second, the green. So we got red and green. So we could go... I know, can't go lolly. We can't do lolly again. We can do orange. Sometimes. Okay. And chips. Orange and chips, basically. We're going to die again, aren't we? Flippy, Nick. What am I doing wrong? Let's go again. Let's start with chips. Okay, we've caught him. Sweet. Let's go with buns. Okay, we caught him. Sweet. Let's go with orange. No. Let's go with orange. No. Let's go with lolly. No. Let's go with orange. Okay, we caught him. So who... Do we, oh shit, I should have really been making a note of who I've caught. Let's go with lolly. So we need the green. Green loves lollies. Come on, mate. Oh, fuck's sake. Fucking hell. Let's go again. Okay. 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 Pfft. 
What do we want? Blue. So blue sometimes likes buns. But the red ring's always going to come out. We need him. Blue loves oranges, so he always comes out for oranges. For fuck's sake. Ridiculous. What am I doing wrong? It's crazy. Alright, we got him now. It's just the same thing happens every time. Oh, hang on. Unless I'm being an absolute... Does it change every time? Loves sometimes... Some, no, that's the same. And what is this? Chips. Sometimes, sometimes hates. Loves. Yeah, that's the same. I can't believe I'm stuck on this. Look, they're all covered out now. No, I've got all three of them out. Maybe once one's fed, they don't come out again. Is that right? So he's at his bun. Does that mean he's now... He's going to come out, isn't he? So maybe go for chips. And now he comes out, so it doesn't matter whether he's just eaten. God, this game is fucking annoying. They're all coming out. What the hell am I doing wrong? Orange. That's the blue one sorted. Bun. No. Why can't I put magic colour on him? Because the blue one's tame now. Oh, it keeps coming out. Scumbag. Restart. <clears throat> oh, we got three. Ah, done it. I don't know what I did different there, but I've done it. Is it, surely it's not just pure luck. I understand the puzzle, but I don't understand... Oh, fuck it, I've done it. Just ignore it. If I'm being stupid, which I probably am, please humour me. Now that the dragons are tame, you can go into the cave to rescue Claire. She's very pleased to see you. Well done, you found Claire and Anna. Remember this password, River. Okay. So we've almost done the game. I think hopefully there won't be too many tricky puzzles like that last one. You know, as I keep saying, aimed at primary school level. And I got I had to use save state to get past that. That's because I'm obviously very, very stupid. River. Okay. So there's six kids and we found four. So there's Jessica and Daniel left.
Okay, mate, come with me to the land of mystery. I should use my save states again, just so we don't just so we don't have to sit through a crap quick save. There we go. So not too cheaty, just so we don't have to sit through that star. You are where the red cross is. You must decide which path to take. Okay. Where do you wish to go? Cottage? It's bound to be the witch's cottage, isn't it? You're outside the cottage. There's a huge key on the ground. Do you want to take the key or go inside? Take the key. You have the key. Do we not want to go in? All right, we won't go in. You're on a high hill. There is a lake nearby. You can see a castle and a cottage. In the distance, there's a forest. Very smoky near the forest. There must be a fire burning there. A giant voice says, I am a hungry giant. Shall I eat you? Uh, no. You better run away quickly then. Okay. Uh, lake. If you want to use my road, you'll have to tell me what sort of trees grow in the forest. Uh, pine. Sorry, you have to go back. Forest. You cannot go straight there. Where am I? Yeah, I'm at the hill. Castle. You cannot pass away unless you can answer my question. My brother lives in water. What is his name? If you don't know, have a guess. Um, Chris. Chris, you may not pass. I'm at the hill. Okay, back to the cottage. Outside the cottage. Mm, I'm still scared of going inside. Forest. Find out what these trees are. Welcome to Creepy Forest. These trees are pom pom trees. Pom, pom, pom. Please take your litter home with you. There is a fire near here. You can put out the fire. Fetch some water from the lake. Okay, we can go to the lake, can't we? If you wish to use this path, you must bring me a stone from the hill. Bloody hell. Cottage. <laughs> Don't go inside. It's bound to be a witch in there. Guarantee you. Hill. You're on a high hill. There's a lake nearby. You see a castle and a cottage. Distance there's a forest. Can we take a stone? Giant. Oh god, it's this guy. No. Better run away quickly. Lake. Pom, pom. Thank you, you may pass by. This is my lake. Have you come for water? Yes. I want a key to, key to eat. Uh, yeah. Take some water from the lake. Do you want to find that? Yes, I do. Red horn. I can see why he's called that. Red horn. Right, we're getting somewhere. Okay. Oh, I should save this, shouldn't I? Quick save. Uh, castle, is it? Go well, back to hill and then castle. Or should we see if we can get a forest? Forest, put out the fire. Just don't know, we haven't got that. Sorry, mate. Castle. I am watching you. That's slightly scary. Changing colour eyes. Who is it? Okay. No. Okay. I am the keeper of the castle of dreams. I am hungry. To enter the castle, you must bring me a cake. You are at the castle. F forest. That was not a good idea. Oh. Dead. Good job I saved it. Quick load. We are at the lake. Hang on. Go back to the cottage. Oh, for fuck's sake. Quick load. Uh, back to the hill. Uh, pom. Pom. Thank you. High hill. Lake nearby. Castle on the cottage. Giant voice. I'm a hungry giant. No. Okay. Back to the cottage and then... To the forest. Maybe we need to go in. I'm too scared. 
forest, put out the fire. Yes. Now what? The fire is now out. You can see a tall tower. Door is wide open. Do you want to go in? Quick save. Yes. You enter the tower and you find Jessica. You Now you must find Daniel. Okay. So one left. Um... What do we need? We need a cake to get in the castle, is that right? We need a stone from the hill. Maybe we go to the cottage. Should we go to the cottage and go in? Yes. The witch is inside the cottage. Oh, sugar. She has a cake in her hand. Yes. You have a witch's cake. Why didn't she eat me? Um, stone from the hill. Should we see if we can get to the castle? Forest. Creepy forest. Pom -pom. Yes, we know. You tell us every time. Oh, shit. God, this is tough, isn't it? Okay, so where are we? Cottage. Hill. Hungry giant. Shall I eat you? Wonder what happens if you say yes. Let's just let's just do a quick test. Yes. Don't be silly. Oh, I don't really eat people well. Not many. Oh, there's a nice one. Lots of white stones here. Yeah, I do. We've got a stone. Uh castle. You cannot pass away unless you answer my question. My brother lives in what? What is his name? Red Horn. You may pass. Oh, good lord. Oh no, this is just for fella, isn't it? It's for fella from the castle. Whatever his name is. Baron Rainbow or something. Come on, mate. We get it. He got colourful art, colourful eyes. Castle of Dreams. Hungry. Cake. We got a cake. You need a key to open the castle door. Someone ate the key. Oh, for fuck's sake. Someone ate the key. Okay. So I can't... The save state won't help me here. Oh. Ha ha, now I've got you. Okay, send you home at once. So we can't let that goon eat my key. Okay, yes. At least we know all the answers to stuff now, like Pom Pom and Red Torn. Maybe that's the idea. Maybe you can't do it on your first go. What's the password? What is it? River. Yep. Yep. So we have to go to the forest, put up a fire to find Jessica. Land of Mystery. Okay, save it here. Quick save. Uh, Red Cross, where do we go? Well, we can't go to the forest until we've got water, so cottage. Oh. Cottage. Yep. Huge key. Take the key. Um. Someone who ate the key? Some goon ate the key. Oh, fuck off. Jesus Christ, straight away. Cottage. Maybe you go to a hill first then. Take the key. Hill.
Hungry Giant. Uh, yes. Good, good man. White stones. Yes, take a stone. Okay, let's go to the lake. Sort of trees and pom pom. Thank you. It's my lake if you come for water. Yes. No. So, how are we meant to uh, do that? So, you brought me a stone from the hill. Thank you. So, we can't put the fire out without water, which means we lose the key. Hmm. So, how do we do it? Can't get the water unless we get the key. Okay, so we can't get the water unless we lose the key. And once we've lost the key, we can't get in the castle. <clears throat> How strange. Yes. <laughs> so we've got another stone. Castle. Red horn. Oh, maybe you go in the castle first. Because now we've got a cake and a key. Yeah, that must be it. Okay, wicked. Worked it out. Yep, no worries. With your key, you open the castle door. You keep the key. Great. Wicked. I think we're almost there. You're in now in the castle of dreams. Everything is strange now. Are you ready to explore? Yep, once I've saved it. Yes. Oh, it's old Achu. Hello, mate. How you doing? Still sneezing. Been eating cock. Whoa. Whoa. What on earth is happening here? It's a young girl. What, with being eaten by baby dragons? Who knows? <laughs> this is fucked. That's definitely fucked, surely. What the hell was that? You have found Daniel. I thought the game had fucked. Was that meant to be? Was that was that legit? Was that was that programmed? Did they look at that and think, "Yep, that's what we wanted"? Jesus, right? Um, lake. Yes. Fine. Yes. Thank you. Nah, it's red horn. Forest. Yes. This is it. I think this is the last bit. Trees, pom pom trees. Throw water on the fire. Fire is now out. Tall tower. Doors wide open. Yes. And then this is Jessica. That's the sixth kid. And I think, ladies and gentlemen, that is Granny's Garden finished. I think that's the end of the adventure. I hope you enjoyed it. There you go. Nice, thank you. Well, that's Granny's Garden on the uh, BBC Micro. Remember playing at primary school, so I would have been probably six, seven, eight, that sort of age, and Granny says it's time for tea. I don't know what's got to do with Granny. 
Anyway, that's fun, sort of, wasn't it? I got stuck on a couple of the puzzles. I don't know whether that's because the puzzles were a bit weird and they were meant to be trial and error or whether I'm just thick. But it's aimed at, like, six-year-olds. But I still got stuck. Anyway, it was good fun. Anyway, it's available to buy now still. Strangely, I bought it a couple of years ago on the iPad on iOS. So it's I think it's probably still out there. It's good fun. Good to show... If you're of my sort of age, late 30s, 40s, and was playing this sort of stuff at school in the 80s, it's fun to show your kids the sort of stuff we used to play, I guess. My kids enjoyed it anyway. Um, so have a look out for that. Thanks for watching. I'm off. That's Granny's Garden. Done. Completed. Sort of. Save states. Shh.